Hi, welcome to an audio test session with APX. These videos provide worthwhile information for APX users and demonstrations on a range of audio measurement applications. In this session, Eric demonstrates how to connect to an APX test system from a remote desktop connection. With so many people working from home these days, some may want to remotely connect to and control the APX 500 test system at work from a home office. In this short audio test session, I'll describe and demonstrate a method to do that. Control your APX analyzer and audio test system from a remote location. Here's what you'll need to do this. VPN or Virtual Private Network Software, VPN Client Software, Windows Remote Desktop Software, and optionally, a Remote Control AC Power Switch. A virtual private network provides an encrypted connection between your off-site computer and the company network at your office. A VPN server is set up and then each computer you want to connect to the network uses a VPN client program. There are plenty of VPN solutions out there to choose from. Here at Audio Precision, we're using Global Protect VPN from Palo Alto Networks. You'll need to work with your IT department to get VPN software installed and configured if your company doesn't already have it in place. Remote Desktop Connection is included with Microsoft Windows. You'll use this to make the connection over the VPN to your computer in the office or lab, which runs your APX Analyzer hardware. Optionally, if you want to connect to different APX analyzers, one at a time, or control the AC power supplied to devices under test, microphone power supplies, loudspeaker amplifiers, or other devices in your test system, an Ethernet-controlled power strip is very handy. We use a device called a Web Power Switch, which you can find on Amazon.com. It's a power strip with multiple outlets that can be independently turned on or off via a web page in a browser. If you have multiple APX analyzers, turn them all on, connect them all to a USB hub that's connected to the host PC, and connect each AC power supply cable to the web power switch. When you want to use an analyzer, first open a VPN connection, then open a remote desktop to your PC, next Open a browser to the IP address of your web power switch and turn on the outlet for the analyzer you want to use. Finally, launch your APX500 measurement software on the host PC. If you don't use the web power switch option, you can connect only one APX analyzer and you must leave the APX analyzer and other AC supplied devices in your test system turned on. If you have a wireless guest network in your office, you can use it to test your complete VPN remote desktop system using your laptop while you're at the office. Better to sort out any issues before you leave to work from home. This concludes our audio test session. Until next time, this is Eric signing off. Thanks for watching. Thank you for joining us for this audio test session with APX. For additional videos, visit ap.com or any of our social media channels.